Hello and welcome to AutoBot YouTube channel. So today we are going to learn about how you can convert an Excel file to a PDF document. Okay, so there can be requirements like uh, you will be getting some uh, data table uh, from or uh, you may be scrapping some data from uh, any of the website and you are converting that to an Excel sheet and you will have to convert that to a PDF document to upload to some uh, uh, website or to some uh, uh, upload functionality. Okay, or there can be requirements like you will have to send that as a PDF document to the customer, right? So like that, uh, there can be a different situation where uh, there will be necessity to convert the Excel to a PDF document. Okay, or uh, if there is a uh, Excel sheet with some uh, 50 pages or 100 pages or a thousand sheets are there. Okay, so maybe uh, out of those sheets, maybe you will have to uh, convert what particular sheet to a PDF and you will have to uh, send that to the uh, customer right so like that uh, different scenarios can happen while uh, you are doing uh, some automation for your organization okay so today we are going to learn how you can do that using the ua path okay so let's create a, a new project i'm going to convert uh, give the name like excel to pdf okay just create it uh no okay so for the demo i already created a file an excel sheet an uh, excel document with the three sheets okay sheet one sheet two and uh, sheet three okay so sheet one is having few data and sheet two is having few data and sheet three is having a uh, few data okay so in this demo i will show you like how you can convert all these sheets to uh, the pdf document and how you can convert only few uh, needed uh, sheets okay so maybe if you want to uh, convert only this uh, sheet 2 to sheet 3 to a pdf that's also possible in the ui file so our project is open open the main workflow okay so the first thing is we have to open up this uh, excel sheet right so for that we have to use use excel okay so let me search for the uh, file desktop automation excel demo okay so that is done then what we have to use so for converting to pdf there is a ready-made activity which is available in the ui path uh, activities okay so um, let me search for excel yeah so here you can see save excel file as a pdf okay so you need to use this activity to convert a excel to a pdf document so let me drag and drop this activity okay here it is asking for enter a vb expression so here you need to provide the path of your workbook okay so let me click on this this is excel okay because here already it is created a reference for the excel which we already opened okay so it is referring to that particular excel okay then uh, what we have to do we need to save it as a pdf document so let me name it like um, my pdf okay pdf dot pdf right so this document and if you need to replace uh, an already existing you can enable this uh, this one and in the properties you can see you know, the quality like what is the quality of the doc pdf document that you need to keep okay standard quality is the default one and if you want only the minimum quality you can choose minimum quality as well okay and here uh, in the input you can see a stop export at this page is there okay so this is the end page so suppose if you are choosing it as two mean it will take only one and two okay so i hope that is clear and start page also you can choose so suppose if you are choosing uh, 2 as a starting uh, page and 3 as the uh, end page means it will take uh, or it will convert only the second page as well as the third page to the pdf document third page in the sense like the sheet 2 and the sheet 3 to the pdf document okay and if you want to replace existing you can enable uh, this if you enable here it will get repeat here as well okay so that's it let me try to execute so here we are not using any value for end page and start page and let's try to execute this
Okay, so you can see the process got completed and let me go to the project. Just refresh it. Okay, here you can see a new PDF file got generated. Let's open that. Okay, so whatever the data which is available in the Excel, it got converted to a PDF document. Okay, so each sheet will be converted as a page in the PDF document. Okay, so you can see all the three sheets got addressed in different pages to the PDF document. Okay, and in case if you don't want to uh, convert the data from sheet to one, okay, you just need to get only sheet two and sheet three. Okay, then what what you can do for that? Here the start page is there, right? So in the start page you can mention like two. Okay, two means it will start from the second sheet. From the second sheet it will start. And if you want to uh, add a stock end page, so it means if there is some sheet four, sheet five is there, and you don't you don't want to go to sheet four, sheet five, and all, you want to stop the conversion uh, at sheet three means you can give it like a three. Okay, so let me do one thing. Let me create one more sheet. Let me copy the same data. Okay, let me paste it again. Okay, so now we have a four sheets with the data. So let me try to execute this script again. Okay, our execution completed. Refresh, then open the file. Okay, so at this moment, you should convert only sheet two and sheet three. Okay, so you should not take the data from sheet one and sheet four. So let me open the PDF. Okay, so we have only two pages. So, uh, what is this data? Okay, sheet 2 data is available here, and uh, sheet 3 data is available in the second page. Sheet 3 data is available in the second page. Okay, so this is how you can use the uh, activities in the UI path to convert and excel to a pdf document also you can limit the uh, pages uh, as per your requirement uh, in your uh, rpa uh, process okay so hope you are clear about this concept if you find this video interesting please like the video please share with your friends and please don't for forget to comment your valuable opinions okay and please subscribe to the channel so thanks for watching the video bye